is Eric Windheim, building biologist and electromagnetic radiation specialist. It's a brand new Square D all-in-one panel. Brand new service drop, brand new service drop, weather head, all that. Uh, we have 0.15 amps on the system ground to the stake here, but there's a ground coming from another location. It's also got current on it. Now what we do know is that with all breakers off, we have zero current on this new conduit and zero current on this new conduit. But when we turn on the bedroom breakers, the magnetic field meter down here on the ground registers higher magnetic field. And now we have 2.6 amps on this conduit and we have 2.4 amps on that conduit. So we're missing 0.2 and we're finding it right over here on the ground wire. So that's about where the, the you got 0.25 here, you got 0.6 here, and you got 0.4 here. <laughs> so the difference between these two is going on to the ground wire. But in any event, this appears to be a violation of National Electric Code 300.3b that says that all conductors of the same circuit must travel in the same raceway conduit tray. And that's not the case here. And one more time, let's take a look at the net, the net current there, the net current there. We turn this one off. It goes away. Okay, so there's a misconnection somewhere in the house. It appears to be between the 15 amp bedroom circuit for the son and daughter and the 20 amp GFI circuit in the kitchen. Thank you.